What up guys, Ruben Hero on 38th unboxing video and I have a big one here for you guys today. What is it? What is it? Well, I have a Facebook account and I was um, looking, you know, just scrolling through Facebook and I found an ad that led to a website called Differo. Basically like, uh, I guess a longer version of saying different or a shorter version. <laughs> so... I found these cool military looking boots and they're leather and I've been looking for some, for some long boots. Apparently, I guess only women can wear those kind of boots, so I don't know. I, I mean, I've been looking for some good looking work boots basically. And this is probably the one package that cost me the most money. I paid $120 for it and the original price I think was $165 I think if I remember correctly. I can't remember. But yeah, it's the point is I paid $120 for it and it's really cheap. So yeah, here are some long boots. Probably will not be wearing them for y'all, but we'll see. Um, besides this one, I think the longest um, unboxing, I mean the longest packaging, the, I'm sorry, the most expensive package I've ever ordered was probably um, $100, and that was like the Batman Arkham Asylum uh, figures, you know, the, the whole series with Harley Quinn, Poison Ivy, Joker, Scarecrow, and Batman, so, yeah. And that was from Big Bad Toy Story. So anyway, let's go ahead and get this thing cracked open. Um, so yeah. So as you can see right there, it says Diffro, Diffro.com. And yeah, that's where I ordered it from. Okay, so like I said, it's a huge package there ago. I just kind of opened it like that. And there it is. If I can get it to focus. Mm. There it goes. All right, so. So this paper that came in basically telling you some info from information you don't need to know. And yeah, it was free shipping. Uh, let's see the total shipping charges, free shipping of course. Uh, so yeah, like I said right there, it cost me, if it'll read, 120 tax, 119, and there you go. So yeah, 120 dollars. Alright, so let's get to the actual package now. So it looks a bit damaged, but that's okay. It says J75, whatever that means, by jump. So cool. Ooh. All right, so I'm gonna need to stop it a little bit here. Okay, so there's that huge box, and there's this other huge box. Let's throw that away. And here it is. Let's open it. So there it is, guys. Ah, oh, yeah, they look pretty cool to me. So, yeah, and this comes straight from New York City, so. so that's a little paper that separates them, I guess. And these these are the beautiful-looking boots. Wow. They look amazing, guys. Look at that awesome buckle. It's brown leather. It's beautiful. Totally worth $120, man. So far, yeah. So, yeah, in case, in case you're wondering what size are these. They're size 11s. I got a big foot. Yeah. Look at that cool zipper. These things look amazing. They look badass, man. Yeah, so yeah, they got that cool new shoe smell, that new leather smell. They're kind of heavy too, man. These are cool. Really heavy boots. So yeah, and it's weird to have shoes on the bed, so I'm going to take those down. Take this one down too. Yeah, it's basically... I like the design of this box, man. I really do. So they're... Here are the shoes, guys. That 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 looks or boots, my bad. So yeah, they look pretty cool to me. So yeah. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'm gonna go ahead and upload another video over um, all my X-Men uh, movies DVDs that I have. Set those aside, and along with my Vans, my jacked up Converse, and my all oh, these other Converse I have there. Yeah. So anyway, yeah, I'm gonna be doing a um. A review over all my uh, X-Men movies in honor of the new Logan movie and I probably will go see it today so I in case you guys didn't know I'm a huge X-Men fan and I cannot wait to go see that movie it's gonna be the last um, movie Hugh Jackman's gonna be playing Wolverine and also Patrick Stewart as a professor Xavier so um yeah and memory of him so yeah anyway guys thanks for watching as always this has been Rubik's film and I'll see y'all guys later peace out